Hey baby, Sunshine Goddess 33. How's your girl guys? Yes, baby. Happy Friday and I'm back for more for you guys. So what I need you to do is hit that notification button down below so you're notified when I post my videos, okay? So energy energy for resonate, it pick the parts that resonate if not, but also I offer a variety of services. Readings, writings, candle rituals, pictures, spiritual consultation. My, my divine job goes beyond a tarot. I don't even need tarot cards, but so email me sunshine goddess 3 to 3 at gmail.com all my information description box down below memberships oh my gosh guys i have a lot of people on my memberships i'm so membership gang i'm gonna post at least three to four videos a week for you guys it's very intimate group right now so and in our videos if you it's because you know what i'm saying youtube it's the stuff that everyone can't see unless our membership so so and my membership please on our videos drop down information below i could pro probably do personals for you guys um, as membership so um yeah so i was really excited to get back to do my reading because when i cleaned up i had got fear and and good news i'm excited so i was like whoa i would like rush <laughs> i like rush back to do this and also uh <clears throat> these cards were on the floor before i left so so i do know that it's a heavy burden for somebody who wants to come forward spend more time with people that want you in their life and less time of chasing the people that you have to that you thank you phone for clarifying that that you listen everyone can't see your value it just it, they don't okay and and it, you need to go around people and be around people that do value you friendships relationships connection job like it's it's important and imperative to be around people that see, you, you shouldn't spend your whole relationship the whole time sh telling someone you're worth it if they don't see it then you should either move on and take care of yourself or move on to someone that sees your worth. It's pretty simple. Life is really simple. I think we just make it way harder than it is, okay? So spend, focus your time on people that want to be around you and less on the time, like the games and stuff. We have one life to live. You don't wait for let someone save you for last, okay? That's what Spirit said, don't let someone save you for last. So somebody's really anxious about coming forward i feel like somebody's really anxious about coming forward because he's in a suit and tie and someone talked to him which i'm saying this is spirit it could be an older guy but i'm saying spirit because it's in the blue and to the guy in this person to you you may get a call or text message it's good it's to the person sending it it's going to be good news but to you it's going to be like is this what I want? Okay, because I feel like when people show you who they are, believe them the first time. But we'll get into what to see. Is this person, are they sending a message because they want to come back and you already moved on and, and you don't, you know, sometimes when we move on connections and stuff, it, it we were so hurt. And I'm speaking because I've read, like, guys, I've, I've been in a few relationships, well, only like three, but but we you're so hurt that you like, you know what, I, I can't do this anymore. I know that you hurt me. I know you're capable of hurting me. It's almost hard for me to open up and even let you back in. That's scary. You know, that it could be scary. But people do change. But but thank you for clarifying. But I feel like in, in reference to that, like, like out of me, I just, I feel like once someone shows you who they are, believe them. Once someone makes you feel unwanted, it's kind of hard to go back. Once you fall out of love with someone, it's kind of, it's, it, I mean, and then you're asking them to do a lot just to prove their love to you. When, 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 if you were just loving them the, the first time, if you had good heart, good intentions and they ruined it, that's going to be have to, a lesson they're going to have to deal with. Okay. So for the next time and, 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 you know, wish them well, don't ever wish anyone bad or ever wish that they can't be with someone or ever wish that that they never find love because that's not who you were. Remember, your love was always unconditional for this person or these people, okay? So, so before, okay, so Spirit, let's get let's get down to this. I like low-key wanted to do traditional tarot on this, but I'm gonna do these first, okay? My tarot card's running away. You running away? Spirit, can you clarify this? Fear, energy, and nine of swords. Okay, so this could be a soulmate energy. And when I get looked for the signs, is I feel like this person was intuitively guided to be with you, intuitively guided to be in this connection. And and their anxiety, their fear of commitment, their fear of relationships, it they just kind of like, they just kind of let it go by the way. So Spirit, can you clarify good news and the 10 of wands for me, please? So somebody may call you and say, listen, um, I ended that third party connection situation. Spirit, can you clarify this? I think that's why you moved on from this person because of third party. But I love you and I realize I loved you and I realize that I want to be with you and I realize I want to take this journey no matter what because I feel like you were really passionate about this person and you really want to be with them. And they took the, the path of 
least resistance and did everything the easy way and went for a third party the whole time they were in love with you the whole time spirit was sending them signs this is your person this is someone that you should be with fear anxiety cause them not to thank you for for clarifying and now not only can they not sleep they have relationship anxiety so i feel like the only way that they feel like that they'll get right is if they reach out to you either they're going to send you a message of apology or they're going to send you a message saying i know i messed up i really want to be with you but that's up to you if you want to take this person back okay so can you clarify look for the signs soulmates fear because this person knows they didn't treat you right 100 percent knows that they didn't treat you right almost to the point where they created a toxic relationship out of fear of them while you're over here loving them 100 percent with your unconditional ass love here they go with their fear here they go with the anxiety here they go turning this relationship connection into a toxic relationship connection okay so can you clarify third party and cupid please they think this person this energy whether you want to say no or not they think that you're not gonna like like accept them back in their life they're they're almost sure that you're gonna say no and i feel like maybe your spirit guys are saying listen that connection's not for you no more it no longer serves you okay so Ray, can you clarify look for the signs soulmates and relationship abuse this person they haven't even dealt with anyone or with any other person after you guys ended that carving cycle they literally had you came in and loved this person so much that you gave them fear i also feel like um that you gave that they had fear of commitment spirit what do we have here cleanse love is coming so i feel like you and your energy you're like you know what i'm going to heal from this and you took some time to heal yourself you took some time whatever baggage you had from that relationship connection you healed from it and you're literally ready to move on not only see see what i'm saying is this energy they feel a new love coming into your life they feel it. it's saying us right now so can you clarify relationship abuse and case closed case case closed where said case closed okay proposal they want to, and look what he's me me at the, somebody really wants to marry you it was 10 10 where he been 7 10 on the clock baby proposal this person wants to come in you know they, they shut down other third parties now they're worried about you having a third party Ooh, spirit clarify this love is coming cleanse energy let me find out you know why because they're watching you on social media energy i can't deal with the facebook others i'm about to put my shit private i that creeps me out if y'all want to follow me just add me as a friend i think that is so creepy to me somebody's watching me i, I just karmics too i know i know low vibrational people are watching me too so it's very can you clear for this proposal energy okay oh because you know why they close off their heart to other people and other connections and they were anxiety because once you get a taste of the real deal nothing else tastes the same baby and everyone can't afford top shelf everyone can't drink top shelf lip liquor and, you know i would say henny but i don't really like that anymore but everybody can't drink patron straight everybody can't handle what you have and this person's realizing everybody's can't give what you have either okay so it's great can you clarify social media and cleanse please also i feel like this person regret some things that they posted on social media because does this hurt the relationship absolutely they know that there's things that they post on social media that hurt this relationship or this connection and they're saying like i'm sorry for doing that does that still hurt the relationship okay now they're saying the gate is open this is divine masculine saying the gate is open and i'm sending you music and 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 i'm sending you how i feel with music okay also this is my message say listen i've been suffering a lot since you've been gone since you've been gone i've been suffering a lot since you've been gone out of this relationship out of this connection so can you clarify on a pedestal please yes now <laughs> something about you posting on social media they saw that knows that you want to come back and be with them or that you're still interested but take your time with this energy because when people show you who they are the first time you have to believe them i don't want to be with someone i have to give a million one chances to i want to be with a person that i have to give one chance to because they understand my worth and my value the first time people make mistakes yes but 101 a thousand and one mistakes no energy's energy if it resonates they regret that somebody really regrets the way they treated you because i guess to see you next lifetime they they know that central guys group energy's energy if it resonates it resonates okay so here, let's clarify this um love language 
love language okay this person regrets not coming in i feel like you're simple to love me i'm a simple woman to love it doesn't take much to make me happy and i feel this person knows that also i feel like they were dealing or suffering with some type of addictions within this connection that you had nothing that you didn't know about maybe they want to open up and tell you that tell you about that maybe that was another reason why they were fearful of a commitment dealing with addictions okay so can you clarify the overall energy for the fear for the fear 10 10 where you been getting myself together because i've been going through some low vibrational things and now i'm ready okay as you face your inner fears you recognize what's holding you back from attracting a healthy loving relationship with yourself and others okay so can you clarify this good news the text message family and friends somebody's supporting this connection and they're encouraging this person to reach out to you they're encouraging this person to to cleanse herself they're encouraging this person because this person's saying like listen i think my divine feminine masculine energy i think they're moving on okay so Ray, can you clarify this interferes please told you they want to reach out somebody wants to reach out and send you a message a conversation is on the horizon baby drunk in love i feel like they may send a drunk text text messages as well the feeling of falling in love is one of a kind you know that it's safe for you to be loved they know that it's safe to love you you know why because they got their asses torn up from a third party situation such as crew energy is energy if it resonates and also this person still gets butterflies the overwhelming and exciting bliss of new and old love you still turn this person on they still are very attracted to you that's why they want to send you this message in fear that you will say i'm straight i love guys that's crew energy is andrew the happy friday keep your head up and your heart close god and i'll catch you guys on my midday mixer or next week whatever come first Mwah.